Hello world of YouTube, welcome. Uh, today we're gonna be doing a reaction to the new, it's a few months old now, I think it's around almost three months old, Bonnie Bear song, uh, P-D-L-I-F. Um, I have not listened to this song and I am upset with myself that I haven't listened to this track. I mean, uh, Bonnie Bear is like, I love you, okay, but you can't do that. Uh, anyways, Bonnie Bear um, is one of my favorite artists of all time, easily. He was one of those big uh, artists for me when I was getting into music, 15, 16 years old. I think the first song I ever listened to by him was um, Perth. Um, like hearing the guitar part of like the song starting off, fuck, made me want to cry. And then Forema, Forever Ago, um, listened to that record as well. Um, and then I was I listened to 22 a million. I listened to 22 a million um, when that was released and I liked it But I wasn't overly the biggest fan, but I've come and grown to like appreciate it a lot more now Like I think the record is fucking like fantastic. It's a, a true experience in and of itself and um, Taking a creative push like that is like intense. So Justin, thank you, bro The fucking Creek song is easily my favorite Bonnie Iver song now because the more times I've listened to that record uh, and I am I um, I like I am I but I haven't really went back to it since the, it came out listened to it a few times and I was like all right and then put it away and put it on the shelf um, so I'm, I gotta listen to it a few more times potentially because it could have gotten better over what a year now right so who knows but regardless i'm excited to listen to this uh, i guess pdlif stands for please don't live in fear and then he has like it says like pilot bonnie Vere season five episode one is he just talking about his fifth record that's why it's season five i don't know all right let's get into this Nice. Just the piano. He moved into that quite quickly, this transition. It's crazy how much that like trumpet or whatever in the background can hold its own. I love that you can slowly hear the drums in the mix, like in the background. Orchestral part, there you go. Alright, so Please Don't Live in Fear by Bonnie Vare. Um, for a first listen or first reaction to it, I like it. I like it, but I don't really feel a lot of ways for it. Um, this is a quick song. I do think that he does do a lot differently in here, um, but there is definitely, you know, the same style from 22 A Million and I Am I, um, but no um, growth on that sound. And this seems like more of a simple structure and not as um, leading somewhere, or it either doesn't go somewhere grandiose, as a lot of those songs do. Yeah, this song kind of feels like an interlude, to be honest, like a three minute interlude. Like if this is gonna be on his fifth record, I don't think this is gonna be a standout or a highlight track on the album, but um, but it's good, it's good enough, and you'll still listen to it, right? Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, this is just what I'm kind of expecting from him in his career right now, is if he's not going to make a song that blows me away, that this is kind of the, um, at least the best, or the worst quality you, you will get. He doesn't really make any terrible songs, so this is like the lowest quality, and it's still, it's, it's alright, I don't mind it. Um, anyways, if you guys want to see me react to anything else, uh, just put a comment down below, and uh, thank you for watching. Peace.